Welcome back to my channel, it's Birgitte and I am here to show you my completed pages throughout 2017 to 18. If you haven't watched the previous video of me showing from 2015 to 16, I recommend you go watch it. You can find it here. So let's get started with the pages. All right, I will start with this uh, coloring book called I Love Coloring Cats. Uh, this is a super tiny book. And the only page that I have done in here in 2018 is this one. This was colored with uh, watercolors and then some shading with um holy chromos and then i also did some posca with with the sky here in the in the clouds there's some tiny bit of shininess in the nails here that was that one then i have two pages in animal kingdom by millie marada and that is This one, this was a old whip that I started back in 2015, but then I finished it in 17. Um, I have used the color grip pencils and holy chromos. And we have one in the back. There's this one and this is done with holy chromos. And then some Mungo pastels in the background. I really <laughs> like this one. So that was Animal Kingdom. Then I have one in Wild Savannah. And that is this one done in 2018. And this is done with Holy Chromos and some white Posca or gel pen and then there's also tiny dots with eyeliner to make an effect. That was Wild Savannah. Then we have one in Tropical Wonderland from 2018. And that is this one. And this is done with Mungo pastels in the background. I made a gradient here. And then there is holy chromos on the feathers and then some 
white Posca as highlights. Then in 2017, I got this book. Um, I actually have only colored in it that year. I started off in the front here with polychromos. These ones are so cute. And then we have this one also done with polychromos. And then the last one is this one done with polychromos and Lungo pastels in the background and I drew in all of these question marks and mats because I was having a math exam so I was super stressed about uh, reading for that exam so I needed a break and this is what I came up with I need to color more in this book as soon as possible. So that was Pop Manga Coloring Book by Camilla Sierrico. Then we have Daydreams by Hannah Carlson and I have done three in here in 2018. So that is the front page uh, or this nameplate page and I have used polychromos and some white Posca for details Then we have this one, only with polychromos, not so happy with the background. I don't know what I was trying to do. I don't know if I tried to do a bokeh background <laughs> or what I did, um, but I don't, yeah, not a fan. I really like the berries though. And the last one is this one, also done with polychromos and white Posca for stars. That was Daydreams. Then we have one in Summer Nights and that is the title page from 2018 done with polychromos. Then we have some Kirby Rosants and this is Mythomorphia. I have done 
won in here in 2018. And that is this one. And if you watched uh, my coloring book collection video, you saw this is was in the uh, Color Morphia book, uh, the Norwegian one. So this took a long time, <laughs> real long time. Uh, I used polychromos and some white gel pen and I think that is it. I'm still really happy with this one. That was Mythomorphia. Then we have Imagine Morphia, and I have done two in here in 2017. That is this one. Uh, there's a lot of glare. Because it is burnished a lot. <laughs> um, I used polychromos here as well. And white gel pen. I do maybe this. The cam camera freaks out if I do this. I think the camera freaks out with all the colors. And then we have this one, also done with polychromos. Still haven't learned the way that I color gold now. This one is more yellowy. Uh, but what I really like about this page is the wings. Uh, I made them look see-through. Because this was not, this was not drawn in the page. So. I think nothing was drawn inside of the wings, like here, but I drew it in. Let me know if you want, want me to show how I did it. That was Imagimorphia. And we have five pages in uh, Animorphia. So I colored a lot in this book, those two years. The first one was this one, and this was an old VIP that I continued. Um, I believe it started with the Faber-Castell um, color grip. And then I finished with polychromos, I think. Or I might have continued with the color grip. And then we have... This one 
from 2018. Done with polychromos. And a little bit of white gel pen as highlights. And we have this one from 2018, and this is Polychromos. Uh, I did this effect. I don't remember where I got that from, but I saw it somewhere, uh, and I wanted to try it out. But I don't remember who did it. Um, but it's basically taking a ruler and line up and just draw lines with a few different uh, colors. So there's light green and dark green and a middle green. And then I put some pastels over it to like fade it. And then I use some uh, gel pen for highlight. Then we have this one. This is colored with the good old Crayola crayons. This was done in 2018. And then we have this one from 2017. done with the color grip, I think. It looks like it. If I have done this page now, I would probably have done more than just coloring the things here. I would probably make a background or maybe I have drawn in bees. As it says here. So yeah, that was Andy Morphia. Then we have Enchanted Forest by Johanna Basford. And I've done quite a few in here as well. This one in 2018. So here I have learned to do gold. <laughs> so this is done with the polychromos. And I do believe the greens are the Dervant Artist pencils. And the background is Mingdeo pastels, and then I've done some white gel pen and a few things here. Then we're going back to 2017 when I did this one. I didn't want to color all the details and stuff, so what I did, I just did a lot of colors of pastels in the background, and then I went over everything with a black pencil. And I think it turned out pretty cool. Might do that again on a different page. Then we have this one in 2017. I used the polychromos pencils and some 
white Pasca in, in uh, the sky. I can see now that this page is not finished. <laughs> Do you look at this mushroom? You can see I started with outlining in white, but I didn't finish it. Well, I might do that or not. I don't know. We'll see. I think this is the first time I did a background like this. I really like the rocks here. And then we have one more here uh no this is the first time because this one was 26th mm, oh. yeah 26 and this was 30th so here i drew in some rocks to make it look like the camera was inside of a cave looking out um, done with polychromos and some white gel pen. So that was Enchanted Forest. Then we have one from 2018 in Lost Ocean. And that is this one. This took a really long time. I think this was a whip, maybe a year or something, because it was so tedious. Because I colored everything in polychromos, including all the black background. And every little detail in each of these things. And I do believe there is white gel pen in some of them. For highlight. And I can see everything is shaded. And I will probably not do this again. That was Lost Ocean. Then we have one in Secret Garden. And I have done one in 2018. And that is this one done with polychromos and white gel pen we'll not show this one this was done in 2019 so that will be in the next video secret garden Then we have one in Ivy Link Butterfly. And that is this one. That is the only one from 2018. I was using polychromos and white gel pen. And I really love this page. Get some gold coloring in these, I don't know, things. Um, really love the background. 
Yeah, that was. I mean, think you better fly. Here are some PDFs that I colored. This is from the Twitch um, Great for Kids coloring book that I donated to, to get. This one is illustrated by Oh We Run. That's the Twitch name. Uh, I have used uh, row markers and fine liners, some silver gel pen. And I believe that is it. Then we have this one from Kappa Tattoo. And here I used pro markers and white Posca. And then we have this one from Leven. And this is only for markers. Then we have Johanna's Christmas, and I have done three in here in 2019. And that is this one. And with polychromos and white gel pen. And then we have this one. This one took a long time as well. Uh, done with polychromos and white gel pen. And here I think it's some eyeliners as well. And the last one. This one done with ink tents, observant ink tents. That was Johanna's Christmas. Then the last book is. Magical Christmas by Lizzie Mary Collin. And there are three in here from 2018. That is this one. Done with ink tents. Uh, all uh, pictures in Lizzie Mary Collin's uh, books I use ink tents in. So all the following pages are done with intents. And there is this one. I've also done some white Pasca or gel pen uh, for highlights. I remember it's this one. So that was the last one. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, I hope you liked it. Uh, this was 2017 to 18, and the next video will be 
19 to 20. Uh, stay tuned for that. Make sure to like and subscribe uh, to see more on my channel. And I will see you next time. Bye.